when I walked over to do my first warm up. Uh, as soon, like before I even put my goggles on, I started to tear up because I knew it was it. And I mean, just thinking about everything that's happened throughout these, you know, 24 years in the sport, um, being able to walk out like this, I'm proud of. And I wouldn't have said the same four years ago. So, you know, Ryan may come back another four years, but I'm not. This is it. I said it before, but you guys can say it. this is this is the last time. This is the last time you'll ever see me in the water racing again. And and you know, I think after the relay last night, that's that's why I was, you know, kind of hunched over and, and more emotional than I was in London. Because it actually meant something. Now, I don't want to say London didn't mean anything, but this is how I wanted to finish. You know, I didn't want to feel like I was forced to do something. I did this this time because I truly wanted to. Um, and that's why the emotions kind of took over me, you know, from the moment that I walked into the warm down pool last night um, till six o'clock this morning when I, you know, 5.30 this morning, six o'clock this morning when Nicole and I were, were laying in bed trying to wrap our head around 28 Olympic medals. You know, it, it, you know there was so much emotion that happened yesterday and, and uh, you know, the best part was being able to um, spend the night with my family. Uh, I woke Boomer up, which Nicole wasn't happy with, um, but I wanted to hold my son, uh, and, and uh, you know, it was the best closure um, to last night that, that I could possibly imagine.